A study published in Nature Communications on December 21, 2025, warns that rising demand for minerals used in renewable energy technologies could significantly worsen mining related deforestation worldwide. Before we dive into the details of the story, please take a moment to subscribe to our channel Down to Earth for regular coverage on environment and climate change. According to the study, mining has already caused large scale forest loss. Between 2001 and 2012, 66.20% of deforestation in mining areas occurred in regions where minerals were extracted. After 2012, the situation intensified. Nearly 74.88% of deforestation in mining zones was linked to minerals required for renewable energy production, compared to 25.11% linked to non-renewable energy minerals. Minerals like nickel, widely used in batteries for electric vehicles and energy storage systems, are a key driver. Mining these minerals often involves large-scale land use change and deforestation. The research was led by Xiao Jin Zhang of the University of Hong Kong. The team analyzed global forest loss data from 2001 to 2023, overlaying it with mining locations. The study examined 2,36,028 mining sites worldwide, including a large number of unrecorded mining operations. The findings show that mining-related deforestation is almost twice as high as earlier estimates, largely because previous studies did not account for unrecorded mining. Between 2001 and 2023, mining caused the loss of 19,765 square kilometers of forest, leading to 0.75 pentagrams of carbon dioxide emissions. Tropical forests were the most affected. Mining-driven deforestation in the tropics totaled 10,824 square kilometers, accounting for 0.56 pentagrams of carbon emissions. Cold regions lost 5,162 square kilometers, while temperate regions lost 3,470 square kilometers of forest due to mining. In total, 175 countries experienced deforestation linked to mining. Just 10 countries accounted for 78.99% of global mining-related deforestation, contributing 0.61 pentagrams of carbon dioxide emissions. Indonesia recorded the highest loss, 21.72%, followed by Russia at 10.81% and Brazil at 10.58%. The study also found that 7,441 protected areas worldwide have been affected by mining. Among materials, gold and coal mining were the biggest drivers of forest loss, particularly through unrecorded operations in tropical countries like Brazil, Peru, Ghana and Suriname. Researchers estimate that 40 to 150 million people in low and middle income countries depend on small scale mining for their livelihoods. The researchers recommend forest smart mining policies, especially in low income countries, to ensure that the transition to a low-carbon economy does not come at the cost of forests, biodiversity, and local communities. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any suggestions, please write to us by commenting on the video.